Back in uh, late 2005, I was invited to visit the offices of a new American company. Um, and I got to see some really awesome prototypes, and that's for the Vectrex electric scooter, which is making the uh, rounds now in the U.S. It's getting a lot of publicity. And late in 2005, I got to see the first few uh, sketches and the prototype up in uh, near Rhode Island. And um, I got to see the new plant in the U.S. And I was really impressed with the technology behind the fuel cell and the batteries uh, for the electric one that's using very similar to a laptop. And uh, I love scooters, all types of scooters. It wasn't until uh, 2006 that I was invited to Carlo de Biagio's house. And I got to see the new fuel cell prototype. And I got to check out the new prototypes uh, being manufactured in Italy, uh, assembled in Poland, that hit the market. Biagio's house. This is the fuel cell bike that you look at. And then there's the electric one. Uh, for you guys back in Miami. My new friend. Yeah. Oh, Ducati. I fell in love with this uh, prototype back in 2006 because it was the first one I got to test on the road and I actually got to test it uh, that day. But it wasn't until 2007 when I was invited to Rome to take place in the first uh, testing of roadworthy Vectrixes. And these were the first that came off the assembly line, all in beautiful red at the press uh, unveiling. MRP was invited, of course, that's me. And uh, we got to test out with the mayor of Rome and several celebrities that came out uh, to test out the Vectrix. But don't just take my word for it. Uh, this is the actual first testing of the Vectrix. Please excuse the, uh, the phone um, that's filming here, but that's all I had on me while we were on the, on the scooter, and I can't drive and film at the same time. But uh, talking about the drive, this is, these prototypes were about two years old um, from the new ones that are in the dealerships, and they're amazing. They, they handle fantastic. Uh, they went uphill at 45 miles an hour. The, the charge lasted three hours, and I, I was completely impressed by these early prototypes of the Vectrix. The new ones are even better, the ones that have hit the U.S. market. So if you can afford one, you definitely should go out to the dealership and buy one. Uh, it carries the highest MRP recommendation. So uh, my opinion is if you can afford to get one of these, if you live in California or Florida, definitely go out to your local dealer, ask about Vectrix, uh, do a test drive. The electric bikes are here to stay. The technology is there. Um, I think this is the future of scootering. I think more and more companies are going to adapt this new technology. And I look forward to seeing more electric scooters on the U.S. roads. So anyways, I hope that was pretty informative. And if you have any questions, visit us at mrp-speed.com. And you should be seeing the Vectrix at your local dealer soon.